What is up everyone? This is Mo Tutorials here and today I'm going to show you how to load up your Windows 10's speed and startup time. So basically you're probably like wondering after you've had your computer for a while like you know it's kind of slow when you're starting it up it takes way too long or it's just getting too glitchy and slow even if you have like a fast gaming PC like myself I have one actually and you know there's a few things that you can do and in this video I'm going to show you two things what you can do to increase your load time and in general speed up your PC. So the first thing that we're going to do is we're going to go at, click at the bottom uh, right and click into uh, task manager. So we're going to basically uh, right click into that and go into that. In here, we're going to actually click into startup. So what happens is if you're unaware, when your computer is starting up, there's a lot of like programs that you may have actually enabled that start up while your PC is starting up. Meaning there's possibly like antivirus softwares, games, programs, Skype and whatnot that you may not need that are starting up that is actually causing it to be delayed because there's these loads of files trying to load with little memory or just too much being taken up like from the memory perspective, RAM and all that other good stuff is just getting taken up. So what you can actually do is you can actually disable them from this section here. And if you notice like I use hard, I have it disabled. I didn't need it to start it up. If I want to use it, I can start it up separately. Skype. Steam, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. Like you don't need all of these things to be starting up. Yes, yeah, certain ones such as like Avast, uh, that is my antivirus software. Sure, I obviously want that starting up to catch any possible viruses. Uh, Cortana, I don't need her to be talking to me. I don't even have a. Well, I do have a mic, but I don't need her talking to me. You disable them. To ba you can basically like right click into it to either enable or like like I was mentioning disable it back. So this is literally one of the fastest things you can do. And again, I don't have that many items here in general, but you'd be surprised. I've done this for my friends to like help clean up their computer, like make it faster, and they've had thousands of apps that they were completely unaware of. So in general, you should always do like a check and delete those apps another video for another time but you should be kind of like be able to do that the next thing is and this is like a little bit more of a drastic thing that you want might want to do at the bottom left you can actually in the search bar you can write reset this pc so we're actually going to click into that and you can oversee over here if and it tells you which is really nice i do like this in windows 10 it actually gives you the option if your pc isn't running well resetting it might help this lets you keep or choose to keep your personal files or remove them and then get windows reinstalled so this is actually good to do if you kind of like it's been a while and you just like it's too slow maybe there's a virus maybe there's something you downloaded maybe your kid had it or your brother had it or sister and then it just ruined it and you're trying to make it better so you can do one of two options you can keep your files so this removes apps and settings but it keeps your personal files which is again good to have if you're especially using it for work or school purposes and then you just remove everything you're just straight up a fresh clean start obviously i'm not going to do this but uh just to give you a perspective you do keep my files it tells you like it's getting things ready it tells you like you can do a local reinstall you can do a cloud reinstall etc etc it just gives you like different options so you can actually kind of go down to that route as well uh you can, if you have backups of previous versions of windows you can actually go back to that as well but that's more for like virus purposes and whatnot so yeah those are the top two tips uh on how to basically increase your uh, load time for your pc so yeah, uh, if you guys have any comments, questions, concerns, please let me know in the comment section below. I'm more than happy to help. If you overall like this video, please smash that like button. It helps a lot. And if you're new to the channel, make sure to subscribe and click that notification bell. Other than that, more tutorials out. Peace.